curious person and science is just a fantastic way to really take advantage of that and to fulfill my curiosity and I mean I don't think I'll I think I'll be a student for life I don't think I'll ever stop learning and what better place to be than science for that. Anna is phenomenal. She's intelligent and inquisitive and kind and patient um, and really takes criticism well. She's really humble. She'll take, she's not afraid to walk up to somebody and ask them a question and get honest feedback and really analyze the situation and see what can I do to make this better. I cannot imagine <laughs> Anna doing anything that does not revolve around science. Everything that she does has a common denominator and it's science. The fact that she's reaching back and, and teaching elementary school kids about science and getting them inspired in science, even if they choose not to do a career in science, they have a much more positive attitude towards it, they're willing to learn, they better understand how science works and how, how things are interconnected, which will make them better voters and better, better citizens. In the next five years, I think we're going to see a lot more involvement from, from youths, from young people and students. I already see at science fairs, I have so many peers doing amazing work and one of my areas of interest has really been inspiring, continuing to inspire younger generations of students to become interested in science and, um, and engineering. So I hope that in the next five years that cycle will only strengthen and people will be able to continue to give back to those younger than them and inspire those younger than them to pursue their passions. I love Anna. <laughs> yeah. Yes, she's my inspiration. <laughs>